To install a garbage disposer, disconnect the electrical and dishwasher connections. Then, remove the existing plumbing pieces that are connected to the drain opening. Then you can install the mounting bracket that will hold up the disposer. Next, make the electrical and dishwasher connections. Finally, you can mount the disposer and hook it up to the drain plumbing. Using large channel lock pliers, disconnect the down drain pipe coming from the sink and the connection that attaches it to the P-trap. When both connections are free, remove the parts. Unscrew the large nut that holds the strainer in place underneath the sink. Remove the strainer body. Clean off the old plumber's putty that surrounds the edge of the drain opening. Place a half-inch rope of plumber's putty around the drain opening in the sink. Drop the new sink flange into the drain opening and press it into place. Placing a weight, such as your disposer, on top of the sink flange will help hold the sink flange in place while mounting the sink flange to the sink. To avoid scratching your sink or the flange, place a towel between the sink surface and the weight. From under the sink, slide the fiber gasket and backup ring onto the sleeve. Hold these pieces in place. Next, slip on the mounting ring and snap ring. Tighten the three mounting screws, alternately tightening each screw a few turns at a time, until the mounting assembly is evenly and tightly seated against the bottom of the sink. Next, mounting the unit. All Evolution models install similarly, though there are a few additional steps with the cover control. More on that in a moment. First, for all models other than cover control, hang the disposer by aligning the three mounting tabs with the slide-up ramps on the mounting ring. Hold the disposer in place. Turn the lower mounting ring until all three tabs are locked into the mounting assembly. The disposer will now hang by itself. Insert the discharge tube into the discharge coupler. Then slide the clamp over the discharge tube and position it in the groove over the rubber tailpipe coupler. Rotate the disposer so that the discharge tube is aligned with the drain trap. If the discharge tube is too long, Cut off as much of the tube as necessary. If it is too short, you can purchase an extension. If you are connecting the disposer to a dishwasher, it may be connected through an air gap. Use a hose clamp to attach the drain hose to the dishwasher inlet. Now that everything is installed and in position, lock the disposer to the sink mounting assembly using the special wrench that came with the unit. Insert the quiet collar sound baffle into the sink opening by pressing it into the sink until it snaps into place. For all models, you should test for leaks at the sink flange, dishwasher, tailpipe, and mounting assembly connections. Finally, turn on the electrical breaker to test its operation. 